When we talk about archaeologists, we often mean people with shovels digging up antiquities. However, mysterious discoveries await scientists not only on land, but also underwater. And sometimes these discoveries are made by ordinary people completely by accident. In this video, I'll tell you about the most amazing findings that archaeologists and ordinary people have discovered at the bottom of the seas and ocean. By the way, if you're not already subscribed to Mogul TV, be sure to click on the red subscribe button and the bell next to it. That way you'll always keep up with the new and interesting videos on our channel. Number 1. The most valuable finding at the bottom of the sea was made quite recently in 2015. A Spanish galleon from the early 18th century was discovered off the coast of Colombia. A galleon was a large warship at the time, but it's not the ship that makes it the most expensive finding in history, but its cargo. The fact is that before it was wrecked, the ship had been carrying a valuable cargo with lots of gold, silver, and precious stones. To date, the value of the cargo is estimated at $17 billion. Thumbs up if you'd be happy to find such a treasure. It turns out that in 1708, a galleon called San Jose was carrying not only a valuable cargo, 60 cannon, but also nearly 600 crew members. Eventually, there was a military collision with another ship off the coast of Colombia. During the battle, the gunpowder in the hold exploded and the ship sank. Out of several hundred crew members, only 11 were rescued. As a result, in 2015, the Colombian military discovered a shipwreck. However, it still lies at the bottom of the sea. While scientists are figuring out how to carefully raise the shipwreck to the surface, politicians are arguing over which country has right to the treasure. Colombia claims the treasure belongs to it because the Colombian military found the ship, while Spain says that since it was their ship in the 18th century, it belongs to them several hundred years later. Number 2. The Lost City of Lord Kushner just off the coast of India, at the bottom of the ocean, there is the lost city of Lord Kushner, called Dwarka. It's one of the most investigated and documented ancient cities that has been swallowed up by the water element. Archaeologists believe that this city is about 9,000 years old. Before being swallowed up by the water element, it had been the largest port city of the country. Today, at the bottom, several ancient buildings and even streets where people walked many thousands of years ago are still preserved. Number 3 mysterious bottle of liquid. In 2015, an amateur diver was scuba diving in the Atlantic Ocean off the coast of Canada. There he found an old bottle with some murky liquid inside. It seems to be nothing surprising, just dirty water in the bottle. However, it was still tightly, which means there is nothing could get into it from the outside. The bottle looked quite old. The diver managed to read the inscription on the cork. There was a signature in English, Keith Brewery, it turned out that such an enterprise really existed in that area of Canada in the 19th century. The bottle was eventually given to scientists for analysis. It turned out that inside there was beer brewed in the 19th century. Moreover, after careful analysis, which determined that the contents were not dangerous to human health, the researchers ventured to try the product. They appreciated that the drink was still similar to beer, but in addition to the fruity notes, there was a distinct taste of rotten eggs. Actually, the bottle was spent a century at the bottom of the ocean. Number 4. Atlit Yam Off the coast of India in the Mediterranean Sea, an ancient settlement was discovered dating back to the Neolithic period, about 8,000 years BC. What happened in that settlement remains a mystery to this day. Apparently, the lives of the people of Atlit Yam was cut short in an instant. Back in the 1980s, scientists accidentally discovered the remains of houses, wells, and several dozen human skeletons at the bottom of the sea. This place is considered one of the most detailed preserved prehistoric settlements. According to the findings, the locals were engaged in cattle breeding and fishing. The main attraction of Atlet Yam was a huge stone structure weighing 7 tons. Almost 30 years later, archaeologists continue to explore the mysterious place, but nowadays it is carried out with the use of modern submersibles. Scientists believe that the settlement was flooded after the Ice Age, but most likely by this time, life in Atlet Yam had already come to an end. The probable cause was a sudden tsunami. Number 5. Antikythera in the 1st century BC, an ancient Roman ship sank off the coast of the Greek island of Antikythera. Just over a hundred years ago, a diver discovered the shipwreck by pure chance. Finally, it became one of the most important discoveries in the history of underwater archaeology. The scientists arrived and discovered bronze and marble statues at the bottom, as well as a mysterious Antikythera mechanism. In fact, it was an ancient computer. It consisted of several dozens of bronze gears and several dials. According to experts, it was used to calculate the movement of celestial bodies and predict astronomical phenomenon. Number 6. Oluburum Shipwreck 
This shipwreck was accidentally discovered by divers at the bottom of the sea near Antilla, Turkey, in 1982. At the time, the discovery truly shocked scientists. It took them more than 10 years to carefully raise all the remains of the ship to the surface. Only after that, the scientists were able to conduct a full analysis of the ship. Then they found out that it was a Phonacinan ship, which was supposedly had sunk around 1400 BC. But most importantly, everything inside the ship had been well preserved. Beginning from the furniture to the different cargoes carried by the ship, ancient gold jewelry, copper bars, weapons, and much more. Thanks to this, scientists have been able to judge the true extent of international trade in 1400 BC. All thanks to a few random divers who just decided to go for a swim. By the way, write in the comments, what would you do if you found gold at the bottom of the sea? Would you keep it? Would you want to give it to scientists? Please write honestly, otherwise it will not be interesting. Number 7. Ice Finger of Death Sometime, while exploring the bottom of the sea and ocean, it is possible to discover not only wrecks and mysterious objects, but also unexplainable natural phenomenon. One of them is the Ice Finger of Death. The scientific name for this phenomenon is Brinsil. It forms under the ice of the ocean. It looks as if an ice needle begins to grow under the ice at the surface and reaches the very bottom, freezing out all the organisms which at this point are crawling on the bottom of the ocean, suspecting nothing. It looks truly epic. Scientists have known about this phenomenon for about 50 years, but only recently, thanks to modern technology, they were able to film it. As they say, if it wasn't filmed, no one would have believed it was possible. Number 8. Herak Leon In the early 1930s, a pilot flying near the mouth of the Nile River noticed from the air that there was something similar to ruins in the water. It took 70 years to thoroughly investigate that place. It turns out to be the ancient town of Herak Leon. Scientists found out that several hundred years BC, it was a developed ancient Egyptian port city. However, the city fell into decline due to competition with other cities. Around the 8th century, an earthquake and resulting tsunami caused the town to disappear underwater. Archaeologists had many discoveries to make. For example, they found 64 ships in the submerged port. This is the largest cemetery of ancient ships in the history of archaeology. In addition, huge stelae and a statue of the pharaoh was raised from the bottom. Number 9. Ancient Roman Medicines Not so often, archaeologists managed to find ancient shipwrecks. However, sometimes the main finding is not the ship itself, but the things inside it. This is what happened to an ancient Roman ship found at the bottom of the sea off the Italian coast in the late 1980s. Scientists couldn't believe it when they realized what they found on that ship. It wasn't jewelry or the remains of ancient utensils. Archaeologists found well-preserved ancient Roman tablets. Yes, at that time, people also needed to be treated, although medicine was not as advanced as it is today. After the study, scientists concluded that the found drugs were used by the Romans for treatment of eyes. Number 10. Despite all the amazing findings, the main mystery of the world ocean is still the Marina Trench. It is considered to be the deepest place in the world ocean. Just imagine, it's 11 kilometers deep. It's located in the Pacific Ocean, near the Philippines. To understand how deep this place is, just imagine that the highest mountain on the planet Everest was placed at the bottom of the ocean. It won't even reach 2 kilometers to the water surface. What amazing creatures live at this depth? Those who believe in the existence of ancient monster Megalodon are sure that if it exists, it is probably hiding somewhere at the depth of the Mariana Trench. Although most scientists would disagree with such a hypothesis, the incredible depth of this place continues to generate many mysteries and riddles, the answers to which have not yet been found. Every year, there are several dives of researchers and they discover more and more details about this amazing place. Don't forget to like this video if you found this video interesting, subscribe to this channel, and click on the bell to keep up with new videos. And of course, leave your comments below the video.